Hello and welcome to Boss Simulator 21. We are back and today we are going to be driving the, in, the Enviro 500 MMC. So I have finally figured out how we can use the buses and unlock the buses. You just have to click sandbox mode and then you have to walk to the dealership. So you will spawn all the way over here and I'll show you now. You will spawn here where the bus step was. So you're going to have to walk this long treacherous walk down to here where the bus dealership is but once you go in here you'll have one million whatever currency they use in this game to spend we'll just say it's dollars because we're in the us and you can literally buy any one of these buses oh okay so yeah as you can see here there's quite a lot to buy uh but some of this stuff is expensive so it's going to cost us a fortune i think the envir 500 is one of the most expensive yet yeah, there you go but we shall buy this bus and drive it around the envir 500 mmc Oh, we'll test, actually, we'll test drive it. Yes, that's brilliant. It's perfect because we can test drive. So we'll test drive all the buses, really. So let's test drive the Enviro 500 and explore the map. Okay, so if we go here, and we click the Enviro 500, and we click test drive, it opens up like this. Actually, yeah, let's see. So if we click test drive, it's just open up again. Just curious. So click over here, it's at the very bottom, because it's the most expensive bus, don't know why. Yeah, there is. So, yeah. Interesting, so that's where the Enviro 500 is. So how many stores is there all together? So this is just open that store for every bus. And look at the specifications, actually let's see the specifications here. So down you go. So the Enviro 500, down, 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 down. It has an engine fuel, so it's a fuel bus, so it's quite expensive for a fuel bus. I'm pretty sure that's not realistic. I think it's about 300,000 the fuel. I know the diesel, I think of half a million, so 500,000. Bus load three, engine, okay. It can hold 80 people, 80 people and 53. So that's 123 people, yeah, that's about right. So let's test drive her. So, how long does that stay open? Okay. Yeah, see, this is, you can walk over the, the bushes there for some reason. Oh, 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 that's a buggy, buggy, buggy. Yeah, there she is. Well, let's just look at that bug again. So, yeah, you can see through the wall. Magic. Oh, oh, scary, scary, scary. And then you have pretty much all the specs there as well. So let's go into this bus. So, oh, oh, sorry. I'm, oh, wait. No, so I thought there was a door for a second. No, that's just a window. Yeah, that's just a window. So, yeah, let's just take a look at her from all sides. So, this is what she looks like the Enviro 500. Doesn't she just look weird? Oh, wow. She's open when you approach them. That's pretty cool. Oh, <laughs> that's, a, that's actually like. Uh, you can, that looks like an object. Okay. Anyway, let's actually walk inside the bus and explore her. There she is, quite nice, it's got two staircases. I think this is the Berlin spec. Um, this is the, because they got these buses recently in Berlin to replace the Mandy LO5 triaxles. So they're quite nice. But nice here for Northern, they replaced the triaxles. They're trying to extend the life of the triaxles by installing some sort of special fuel, uh, fuel, what you call it? Um, a, sorry, exhaust pipe, there you go. But I uh, don't know what happened with that in the end. But yeah, this is definitely the Berlin spec. Although I don't think the Berlin spec has cushions. And here we are, ADL. You currently have an active waypoint. Yep, yep, whatever. There she is. This is our cab. The ADL cab. Looks quite nice. So, now we have to start the bus up. Oh, wait. It was already started up. I think. Okay, so, so for some reason the parking brake wasn't activated. So yeah, let's drive. Oh, you can you can only test drive it inside this area. You can't actually. Can you not? No, you have to buy the bus. So the test drive only allows you to drive around here. That's annoying. Come on. But yeah, quite like this bus. I do like the Enviro 500. So yeah, it's nice to finally be able to drive the triaxles. 
So what I might do right now is I might mute the microphone there just so you can hear the bus drive there for a while so I can actually hear it as well. So yeah, I'll be back with you guys in like a minute or two. So yeah, it has rear wheel steering and then also the brakes also apply when you press the forward button when you reverse and cool you funny enough. So you're gonna have to buy this bus in order to be able to drive it around annoyingly. You can't test drive it outside. Let's see what happens if you try to go this way. Reverse. And then... Let's just try to squeeze through there's that invisible wall. Is that like an oyster car tap machine? Kind of looks like that. Ah, this bus is most expensive because it has the most capacity there. Like, pretty much has a capacity of two single liquors. Okay, so now we can buy it. Yeah, we bought it. Oh! Yep, that didn't close yet. So yeah, let's just explore now. Okay. Come on, let's go. Yeah, the damage costs now are quite low. What's up with the people's like colored, uh, the people dyeing their beards here? Because you see people dye their hair, you don't really see people dye their beards that much, but... Hey, cool, cool. So, yeah, let's just explore the map now. So now we just explore the map in this bus and that kind of thing. So, yeah, but we're going to have to create a few profiles, I guess, because, yeah. Spent pretty much all our money on this bus here, but really it's just this bus in Envira 200. I'm sure people are most interested in seeing, but Envira 200 basically is basically just going to be a smaller bus, smaller version of this. Let's open up the map and set a waypoint. We're far away. Let's go to this island. I can create a route, but uh, did that set a marker? No, it didn't. Okay. So let's just drive, see where the road takes us. We need to find a bridge, so I think there's the bridge. So just follow this road here. Yeah, I presume all, all everything's unlocked in the sandbox mode because all the buses are available in the sandbox mode, whereas in the other mode they're not. So you have to unlock them. Correct use of indicator. You don't say. You don't say. Again, I'll probably like st stop talking there for a minute or two just so you can hear the boss. So, yeah. Get some cheeky screenshot. Uh, check this cheeky screenshot just here. I think this one will do. 
That will make for a good screenshot, actually, yeah. Not sure what that wheel keeps like. The back wheel keeps looking like it's down and up. Oh, look, there it is. It is what it is. Yes, now exploring the unfamiliar areas of Angel Shores. Okay, so yeah, let's mute the microphone and let's you guys enjoy some trash. I hope. Well, actually, I haven't removed the speed limiter, but yeah. Let's remove the speed limiter. Esk. Settings. Bus gameplay. Just remove the speed limiter there. Until we're, like, doing that. No. General settings. Yeah, no, disable this. There we go. Actually, no, just enable it, yeah, because we're going to get fined too much. So, uh... Where was this? Um, go back. Go to driving and steering. No, it was general controls. Was it general controls? No, it was a. Oh, wait, I'm in the wrong thing. Gameplay and boss. General settings. There we go. So, yeah, because I thought the speed limit like a proper bit, a speed limit that just limits the boss, but no, it's the speed limit that limits the. Uh, it limits it to the speed of the street. So yeah, again, quite arcade because in real life the speed limit is the boss is the same speed. No matter what. This is quite a nice bridge. Look at that view, especially that side. You can see the whole city. It's quite a dynamic city and also you can see it from far away. So the wind distance is quite good. Yeah, see here the speed limit's high enough. Yep, we're nearly at 100 kilometers an hour. Oh, yeah, because we're on the motorway. So, yeah, let's just we'll keep trying on the motorway, see where it ends, and then we'll pull it. Uh, we'll finish the video there. Nice test drive of the Enviro 500. The top speed of this is 120, which is pretty accurate because I normally see two. That's the top speed of the Enviro 400 MC. This is the Enviro 500 MC, just an extra pair of uh, wheels at the back. Oh, there's a port in there. That's really cool. Is there an airport? I wonder. Screenshot time. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, I'm on the wrong side of the street. Whoops. Oh, that is a nice screenshot, though. That is nice. Oh. Yeah, look at that. That is a that is breathtaking view. And zoom out, and... Nope. Why is it so... Zo oh, because we're close to the curb. Oh, 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 why am I reversing? No, 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 don't do this. Oh, no, 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 that's going to automatically put me back on the right track. But yeah, it's quite a nice map. Yeah, there's a lot to explore now. We'll just uh, go down into the housing estate. It looks like a mountain-esque. Well, you know, there's like mountain -y housing estates that are kind of uh, posh and uh, well-maintained. They kind of stand out. Oh. Too much chit-chatting I'm doing. Is that boss really stuck? How is that? How is she 
How is that stock like? Uh, maybe I just need to reverse uh, with without steering, you know, just having the steering neutral. Let's see, yeah. Well, press and hold C. Huh. Why can't I leave my boss? I can't leave the boss. I'm pressing C, but nothing's happening. Okay, I'm not sure this is a bug, but yeah. Um, we can't reverse out even though we're not hit anything, and we can't move. So, I think that really concludes this video. Yeah, that's some nice trash of the Enviro 500 MC. You've got to see how it goes at top speed. And yeah, she's quite nice to drive. I do quite like it. So yeah, we'll have a video out of the Enviro 200 at some point, uh, and yeah, that kind of thing. So yeah, folks, thanks for watching. I don't know what happened there. Uh, oh, I think the pro ah, I see what the problem is. Yeah, so basically, uh, the back's hitting the bus. You see there, it's tailgating, so that's why it's not moving. So yeah. And I don't think I can take it over because I haven't started the company. So yeah, look at just create a new profile. Easy as that sandbox. You have everything. We have one million, which is enough to buy one or two buses. Oh, AI has disappeared. After a while, kind of like OMC2. Anyhow, folks, that's it for now. Until next time, bye for now.